news that we're tracking as far as the hunger strike, remember, by junior doctors in West Bengal is concerned because now we're given to understand that the IMA has written to West Bengal Chief Minister demands chief minister's immediate attention has gone on to state in that letter let me tell you a quick takeaway of the same that peace and security is no luxury medical fraternity trusts bengal chief minister and ima has said to mamta banerji you can save lives so as we look at of course those protests intensified by junior doctors ima in the purview of the same has returned to the West Bengal Chief Minister demanding the Chief Minister's immediate attention. I do understand Pooja, my colleague, is joining me for more. Pooja, very good morning. Given the kind of, um, you know, intensifying protests that we've been looking at over this particular matter, with the IMA now stepping in and addressing this to the Chief Minister, is it extremely significant development? Oh, well, absolutely. As the hunger strike of seven junior doctors over 10 demands, which have been placed before the West Bengal government enters into its sixth day, we've seen how the Indian Medical Association has written uh, to the West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee seeking her intervention. The letter that has been sent to the Chief Minister says that doctors across the country feel that she could perhaps now enter into this entire issue and resolve it and they have trust over the chief minister's office but now we will have to wait and see whether the chief minister calls these junior doctors who have been on the protest and on the hunger strike past six days and whether there is some standoff that could end at the end of the week Ahead, Pooja. Thank you very much for getting us more as to what the IMA, of course, a quick takeaway of that and also where the protests stand at the moment, given how we've been looking at uh, this panning out in West Bengal. Having